Welcome to Sim UK. Today I'll show you an unboxing for the Frostflow 240L all in one liquid cooling solution from ID Cooling. I won't beat around the bush, let's get straight into the unboxing. The Frostflow 240L is packaged in this nice and informative box. This was initially wrapped in cellophane, but I have already removed that before I started recording. If we open the lid, you can see that everything inside is well protected thanks to the custom designed cardboard housing and the additional polystyrene protector, which was placed on top. You can also see that everything has a protective sleeve in order to limit scratches and the like. And you can see at the back there, there is what appears to be a leaflet is actually the single page fold out installation guide. The installation guide comprises step-by-step -step illustrations with numbered items that correspond with the components list. Each illustration has a brief description and as long as you pay attention to what is said and make sure that you understand the steps involved and of course that you have the correct components then installation is pretty straightforward when following this guide. Next up we have the two 240mm high angled fans, accentuated with a coordinating colour. Both fans have 11 fins, angled to increase pressure and reduce the need for high RPM in order to achieve high through flow. This can increase the noise pollution generated in some circumstances. Each fan measures 240mm squared and 25mm deep. Incidentally, there is a fan cable splitter included with this kit, which should help to ensure that you have enough pods on the motherboard in order to power both fans plus the pump at once. All of the mini components I mentioned earlier are held inside of this small bag. You won't need all of these during the installation as the kit also comes with a mounting plate for multiple variations of CPU. And finally, the main part of this kit is the water block and pump, which is attached to the radiator by these two industry standard pieces of tubing. These cannot be detached as this is a closed loop liquid cooling solution. Effectively, how this works is that water is forced around the loop by the pump, up through one of the tubing pipes to the radiator, where combined with the fans it will dissipate the heat stored within, and then the cooled water will return back to the pump via the other tube to begin the cycle once again. The copper-based coil bottom ensures that heat is transferred away from the CPU quickly, and it does seem to work very well. The pump itself is also powered via one of the motherboard ports and is connected via this three-pin cable. So that concludes the unboxing for this device. If you'd like to watch my detailed review on the Frostflow 240L, then please click here. And if you want to see my installation, then please click here. My name is Mike. This is SimUK. Thank you for watching. Take good care of yourselves. Till next time. Bye-bye.